Well, hello friends, Jason up New Age Revolution Cave for an unexpected video. Very unexpected video. I, uh, I already planned to do an NES show tonight. Hey, you want to play some Nintendo? Uh, that was going to go up tonight, like around 9, 30, 10, maybe even later. But, uh, that was going to be the one video I did today. Yeah, see, I'm going to look, see, everybody's telling me to keep the mohawk, but I think I'm going to look better shaved. I mean, this is just big and up there and I don't even like spike it or put any anyway that's not why you tuned in maybe it is then you're a freak but um yeah I get home today I get in the door around lunchtime or so and there's an XOX package waiting for me an XOX package usually I get a notification from the post office when Net sends me out something, I get a notification that says, Net's sending you something. In the early days, she used to tell me who was coming. And I was like, don't tell me who's coming. I want it to be a surprise. But I would always know that something was coming because I'd get the notification. Well, the last two times, I never got the notification. So I just show up and there's that beautiful white box from XOX sitting on my porch. And I say, oh boy, oh boy, here we go. This is going to be fun. I tear it open. I go through the candy. I eat the Sour Patch Kids. Seriously, just now, there's still Sour Patch Kids stuck in my teeth. My seven-year-old comes by and tackles me for the Tootsie Pop. Mm -hmm. Then I open the package and I say to myself, yes. Yes, this makes sense. Yes. I'm telling you, sometimes we know what's coming. Sometimes we're like, well, of course that's a necessity. Of course Demolition Smash is a necessity. Of course Undertaker's a necessity. Of course, well, I made the Samoans a necessity. So of course the Samoans are a necessity. You know, and then we get surprises like a brand new you know, totally displayable, anniversary, statuesque figure of Randy Savage. Out of the blue, we get an NWA Dusty Rhodes with incredible boots. And sometimes figures just come and I go, oh, I like that. Ron Bass was an, oh, I like that. That was on my top five must-have list. Same era... And this figure would have absolutely been made by LJN because it goes along with the whole WWF, cartoony, over the top, would make a great action figure because of one particular feature on this figure, LJN would have jumped on and made a great figure of. Well, now he is ours. Let me grab his manager. Let me grab, oh, his manager's way up there. Let me, let me grab his manager. Let me, uh, let me grab Bobby Heenan and take him out of his doll stand. Because I have yet, I have yet to get series three of my LJN doll stands. I must, I must do my part better. If you guys want me to have doll stands, that's one thing. If you want me to have custom LJN stands from 4Left 3D Creations... Go buy some from them, and then I can get some. So let me take him out of the let me take him out of the display stand. Now Bobby Heenan has an announcement to make. Bobby Heenan has brought somebody in who I think was actually a very promising wrestler. Um, I loved watching this guy in like Mid South. UWF. I thought he was great. I thought I thought he was a good scientific wrestler. He could have been a bad guy. He could have it could have even turned him into kind of a, a brawler, like a bleeder, you know, like he could have just had wars with Hacksaw Duggan in the in UWF. But he took him and he and he turned him into something else. He turned him into poultry, ladies and gentlemen. Bobby Heenan took a fellow named Terry Taylor and through the magic of the WWF and Vince McMahon, 
we've got the Red Rooster, ladies and gentlemen. The Red Rooster is LJN, and this is what I was talking about. You know that that would have been such a huge, I don't want to say a selling point, but it would have been a huge thing that LJN would have just loved to do. That little mohawk. Check us out. We're twins. Terry Taylor, forget Terry Taylor, the Red Rooster is LJN. Take a look at this. This is a great figure and a great unexpected addition to the LJN line. Unexpected. I did not expect the Red Rooster by any means, but it is a figure that would have been made and a figure that absolutely makes sense. It absolutely makes sense to have the Red Rooster a part of our LJN lineup. Do we need a Brooklyn Brawler now? I, I think so. Red Rooster with Nets' incredibly accurate painting. All red with the RR decals perfectly placed on both boots. And then in the front of the trunks, we have perfectly placed. You can't even tell, folks, that it's a decal unless you get right up close to it and stare at it and focus your eyes and go, oh, yeah, I can see it. But other than that, it just looks like a brilliantly painted, impossibly painted rooster on the trunks. And the, again, the focal point, that perfect mohawk. And that is perfect. It is not a hack job, folks. It is not a glob of, you know, putty up there. It is a perfect mohawk. It is done perfectly. It fits perfectly into the hair. It is it is sculpted on. It's molded on. You're not pulling it off. It is fantastic. This is a great, unexpected figure. I love the play pose. I love the play pose. We got people out there. We got people out there that need a particular play pose. We've heard from you. We got a great play pose with the Red Rooster. This is an... This is an underrated pick. This is a sleeper figure. I'm telling you right now. This is a great, great figure. The Red Rooster is LJN. Terry T Now, if you guys want, I don't know if, I don't want to speak for Nat, but I don't know if the, if, if all of the figures have the molded on hair. I don't know, because you could get the Red Rooster, and if the molded on hair is not there, maybe she can make you an NWA Terry Taylor. Black trunks. I think he I think TT was on the boots. I don't think there's anything on the trunks, but yeah, if you wanted like an old school Terry Taylor, I'm not sure. I don't know if the if all of her um samples are are molded on hair. If not, I don't know. Check with her. Ask her. Communicate with Nat, folks. Communicate with Nat. Okay, Nat has opened the door for all of you guys. We are we are a big part of Nets Enterprise. Okay, communicate with Net. If there's something that you like, if there's something that you don't like, respectfully reach out to her and let her know what you think. She's open to all kinds of feedback. She wants to make an expert product. And she is because, because, like I mentioned last time, somebody else in the wrestling world is starting to make, you know, these big rubber wrestlers, and um, whatever, you know, whatever. I'll tell you a little secret about those. They come in two parts, right? They're, they're, they're put together. So there's a couple of videos online where somebody drops the figure and it breaks in half. They're connected with a wire at the waist. These are not. This is one solid figure, folks. This is one solid figure. The only difference between these figures and the others is there's licensing involved. There's licensing involved, and so far what I've seen from them doesn't compare, does not compare to what we have seen from XOX and Print Fury. XOX and Print Fury are the, the top of the ladder when it comes to these figures, period, period. So get your hands on the Red Rooster now. Go over to Etsy. You know how to do this. I don't have to walk you. I just bought a new laptop yesterday. Right. So when I when I lift, you know, when I open it up and I start typing the www 
.etsy.com, right? Not org or gov, .com. I go to Etsy like that. I blink and I'm on Etsy. And then I got to type a little bit more in and I got to, you know, search around, use the mouse. Got to use the mouse. You get to Random Treasures, XOX by Random Treasures on Etsy and you order up your Terry Taylor, your Red Rooster. Managed by the brain. Then, then we've got a a turning. Remember the remember the heel turn or the face turn when when uh, Heenan was slapping him in the face. He's slapping him and Rooster's getting mad. Slapping him in the face. Rooster's getting mad and then he goes points at him Ooh, and Heenan begs off immediately. I love that. And then we get a WrestleMania match between Red Rooster and Terry. T- I think we got yeah we got Red Rooster and and Bobby Heenan or Red Rooster and. Uh, Brooklyn Brawler, I can't remember. But there we go. Red Rooster stomping on his former manager, Bobby the Brain Heenan. Awesome, awesome addition to the LJN lineup. Incredible. Terry Taylor, Etsy, Etsy Etsy.com, XOX by Random Treasures. Terry Taylor is LJN.